The Taiwan 7 Summit team, as the name suggests, is a team of several Taiwanese mountaineers who aim to scale the 7 Summit. The team has conquered six of the world's highest peaks within three years since 2006. The team is planning to set another record. They want to scale Mount Everest next March. As part of their training for the challenge, they recently climbed up the peak of Mount Zhuoyo, which have an elevation over 8,000 meters, without using any oxygen tanks or aid from the guides. I trained myself by climbing from Batongguan in Dongpu to Mount Yushan about twice a month. I did it within a day. Of course, I wish scaling Mount Everest will be as easy as in the six-hour hike between the Dongpu to Mount Yushan. This is Himalaya, beautiful yet dangerous. It is dreamland for mountaineers, but many die every year trying to reach the summit. In their recent expedition in Mount Zhuoyo, we meet at one point lost contact with other Atuna members. Two mountaineers from another group climbing the mountain without oxygen tank went missing just two days before Umi was trying to make his journey. But Umi was not discouraged, trying to reach the peak without oxygen tank or assistance of the Shepa people in Tibet is very dangerous. Most people breathe into 21 percent oxygen when they are in the regular attitude. But when they reach an attitude above 8,000 meters, they may only be able to breathe in 6 percent oxygen. The oxygen level in their blood may also drop sharply from the average index of 98 and cause a shock. We use this oxygen mask above 8,000 meters high, but when you get there, it's low pressure, low oxygen. This is very different. There is no pressure limit. Bunong people typically live around Taiwan's central mountain range. Bunong children can be trained for this. It's not that there aren't any kids who can do it. You just have to look hard for them. Taiwan's highest mountain is a Sakri mountain for the Bunong tribe. In old times, the Bunong people usually served as mountain guides or the porters. Umin from the Aspukun community of the Tumpu was born in 1962. He became a mountain porter after high school. Umi has passed the toughest test and will try to conquer the world's highest peak, Mount Everest, next March with the three of his fellows in Taiwan 7 Summit Team. TITV Weekly.